Thanks for tuning in to this episode of Brutal Battle Beer Break. Um, as everybody knows, one of the most highly acclaimed pumpkin beers is Pumpkin by Southern Tier. And Southern Tier is out of Lakewood, New York. Um, and so we have a special version for today's episode of the Pumpkin. It is the Imperial Rum Barrel Aged Pumpkin. Uh, I think this is the first time they've done this, and people have been going kind of nuts for it because they want to try it because typically everybody really likes you know, the pumpkin pie type flavors of the pumpkin with the graham cracker to it and all the spices and everything like that. Um, so I'm interested to see how that's going to play with, with the rum barrel. And honestly, I don't think I've ever had any beer aged in rum barrels before. So this will be a first for me on that front. And certainly my first, oh, my second barrel aged pumpkin beer. Uh, the first one I had was, was a shipyard bourbon barrel aged uh, pumpkin beer. Um, this one is 10.7% alcohol by volume, so it's a big one. Uh, as you can see, there's, oh, it's a pumpkin guy, check that out. <laughs> yeah, and then it just says pumpkin, all the da-da-da, whatever, interesting. So, pop this sucker open, give it a nice pour. Alright, as we can see... I mean, it's basically the same color you're going to expect from the regular pumpkin. It's very orangey. It's a lot of carbonation in it, but it's like really large bubbles. Very interesting. Let's see how it smells. Mm, I can definitely smell spirits in there. I get a little bit of that uh, kind of graham crackery note peeking through. It kind of smells a little bit like pencil shavings, too, for some reason. That might be the wood from the barrel coming through. Ooh. Um, and I actually do get some like straight up pumpkin. It smells interesting. Um, the amount of straight up pumpkin I get in it is very much more pronounced than what I typically get out of a regular pumpkin. Out of the regular pumpkin, you mainly kind of get like the graham cracker and the spices. Um, so it seems like the pumpkin is amped up in this. Hmm. Okay. Um, it's interesting because I'm still getting that graham crackery taste. I'm getting a lot of pumpkin flavor to it. And the rum barrel aging has kind of given it this kind of smooth butteriness on top. So it's kind of like if you would have like a, a well-spiced piece of pumpkin pie with a graham cracker crust and then had like some butter laid on top of it. It's given it a little bit of like a vanilla-y note as well to it. Um, which I'm finding pretty pleasant, honestly. Hmm. 10.7% alcohol. I cannot taste that. I would put this maybe 8 or 9%. Um, so I think that they did a pretty good job blending that in. What sits on my palate at the end of each sip is that graham crackery taste. Um, which I typically like, a lot of people like, about the pumpkin beers. So, um, this is good. Uh, I'm a fan. Uh, now that I'm now that it's been sitting in my palate a little bit more, I'm getting like a little bit of a marshmallowy flavor to it as well. So it's kind of like boozy marshmallow buttery pumpkin pie. Um, if that sounds good to you, then this is a beer that would definitely hit the spot for you. Uh, so yeah, Southern Tears um, Imperial Rum Barrel Aged Pumpkin. Thumbs up on that one. Thanks everyone for checking this episode out, and uh, go get yourself a beer.